Trump just announced a presidential pardon that has Mueller on high alert. The President of the United States sent a clear message to his co-conspirators this morning when he announced he would be issuing a full pardon for conservative conspiracy theorist Dinesh D'Souza, who was indicted in 2014 for felony campaign violation. D'Souza was attempting to support the campaign of his friend Wendy Long, who was making a doomed bid for the Senate seat currently held by Kristen Gillibrand, and convinced his girlfriend and her husband to each donate $10,000 on his behalf to Long in their names to avoid the personal donation limits set by the Federal Election Commission. D'Souza then was forced to serve eight whole months in a halfway house, where, according to his book, Stealing America, What My Experience with Criminal Gangs Taught Me About Obama, Hillary, and the Democratic Party, he discovered the truth about racism in America in a series of almost certainly fictional discussions with his fellow inmates. That truth was the disingenuous narrative that the Ku Klux Klan was originally created by Democrats and that racism in America is the fault of the Democrats, which was just one of the many preposterous and demonstrably false conspiracy theories that he has been pushing on the fringes of conservative thought for years and have now fully mainstream. See podcast interns other tweets Twitter ads info and privacy D'Souza's conviction for a crime that he plead guilty to turned him into a martyr for the right wing, who chose to see him as a victim of a tyrannical Obama regime intent on punishing a conservative instead of the just retribution for a man who was either too stupid or too lazy to support his friend's election campaign in a legal manner. The pardon is most likely aimed at longtime Trump lawyer Michael Cohen, who failed to understand the purpose of using multiple shell corporations to launder illegal campaign donations and just used the same company to not only funnel hush money to the president's ex-mistress Stormy Daniels but also to accept enormous payments from foreign oligarchs and corporate entities alike. The relentless efforts of Daniels lawyer Michael Avenatti has uncovered a slew of other criminal wrongdoings by Cohen, including running a fake car crash injury lawsuit racket and helping Fox News host Sean Hannity actually pull off the housing project scam from The Sopranos, and that's just the tip of the iceberg. D'Souza's pardon by President Trump sends a loud and clear message to everyone on his campaign team who is currently facing indictment from special counsel Mueller's team, stand strong and receive a pardon, no matter how guilty you might be.